Tom Brands defended his national championship and rode a 50-match winning streak into the finale against number three seed, the Big Eight champion, Alan Freed of Oklahoma State. Freed led two to one. Going into the second period, Freed wearing orange. Here's how we called it. Neutral. Freed lets France go. That knocks to score two to two. Very close, even match, as everyone predicted. The number one and two seeds. France, the defending national champion, number one seed, 44 and 0 with 13 pins. And Alan Freed, the Big Eight champion, came into this tournament seated number two. Brands will want to play this takedown game. The same with Freed. They both have that same style of wrestling, and Brands lost an excellent opportunity to score there. Not being able to hold on to Alan Freed's legs as they went out of bounds. And it's important to note, even though your opponent may be out of bounds, if your supporting points are inbounds, they'll give you the takedown. And we're still knotted at two. Freed, a redshirt freshman from Oklahoma State. What a great career he appears to have ahead of him. Well, Freed has won the Junior Nationals four yeah. times. He was highly recruited coming into college. I've even watched him defeat a Soviet wrestler, Mike, last year. Freed went to high school at University Heights, Ohio, wrestled under Howard Ferguson there, and was recruited to Oklahoma State. These two wrestlers have a history. Freed defeated Brands last year, but this year, Brands owns them. Two decisions, six to four and 10 to five, and there are only two meetings. In fact, Brands has not lost since the Big Ten Championship final one year ago. Dave Zuniga of Minnesota beat him, but Brands avenged that loss with a quarterfinal victory over Zuniga in this tournament. And Brands took advantage of a poor Alan Freed shot and followed it up with one of his own. And there, a nice finish to get the takedown. He now leads it 4-2. to two. Now, will he let Freed up? Not with this much time left in the period he'll try to ride freed out stay in that advantage position and add some riding time here's the finish to that takedown brands will step over freed's leg and in doing so flatten freed out giving him the takedown tom brands held on to successfully defend his national championship decisioning alan freed five to three Brand's title sustained Iowa's hopes of a record championship score and continued Coach Dan Gable's winning tradition in the coach's corner and on the mat.